It's another gathering of stakeholders in the power industry, but this time at the Iguaji transmission station in Nugu State. So as we are working together, According to the Minister of Power, Works and Housing, Mr. Babatunde Fashola, the federal government has zero tolerance for corruption in the power sector, including consumers. My public appeal to members of the public to extend the whistleblowing policy of the federal government to those who are stealing energy. Let us know your neighbor who is using electricity and is not paying for it because you are probably carrying his own cost. The minister also said he's determined to sanction the electricity distribution companies who fail to comply with government directives. I am getting a lot of complaints about people who have prepaid meters being disconnected. But next month, if nothing is done by those discos to quickly address it, I will make them public. I'm giving them the opportunity to quickly look inwards and see what they can do. Somebody who has a prepaid meter has no business with disconnection. Also, the managing director of Niger Delta Power Holding Company noted progress in the National Integrated Power Project addressing power issues in Ibado Line to Magboro, Okija Distribution Substation, and Aloji in Onicha, amongst others, to be completed in the first quarter of 2018. We're doing a substation by bringing down the power from the line, turn it in to Ihela, and then before it goes back up to Onisha. So we have a Tatri KV station. From that Tatri KV station, we now have a line going from Ihela to, to Newi to supply the Newi community. With the progress recorded at the meeting today, Nigerians are hopeful that words will be matched with action to improve the performance of the power sector.